Welcome to episode 29 of Duo Night. For those of you who are watching this one day early on Patreon, thank you so much for all your support. This episode is super duper special because we have Moist Critical Charlie as a special guest for today. It's gonna be an absolute blast. And if you guys would like to help support the channel, be sure to check out the Patreon in the link in the description box below to get early access to all Duo Night episodes, ultimate losers match, best two out of three finals, and many more. Be sure to check out our Patreon in the link down below. Again, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for helping support Duo Night on Patreon. We will not be here without your generous support. All right, guys, without further ado, let's roll the intro. So here's how the tag duel is going to work. We're going to draft just like normal. We're going to know our teammates ahead of time. That way we can work together on our strategies. Now, in the actual duels themselves, each team will have 16,000 light points. They will share the field, the graveyard, so they only have five monster zones between the team, five spell trap card zones between, and one field spell zone between the team. Now, the turn order goes pretty simply. It'll alternate between each team taking one turn. That way, everyone gets to load up their cards. Now, because we share fields, there's a lot of cool plays that can happen. We can set spell and trap cards on monsters for each other to use. That way, a lot of these complex combos can happen a lot easier than they would in a normal duel. Now, the active player will be the turn player or the person who just had their turn. That player will be the person who's in control of all the trap cards, any of the effects, and if any of the cards from the field graveyard get returned to the hand or deck, they go to the active player's hand and deck. Everything is shared, so really is a true team effort in this one. And it's going to be one you will not forget. Get your game on! All right, guys, so here it is, episode 29 of Duel Night. We're back in Tampa, Florida, and Moise is here. Charlie is here. The reigning Duel Night champion, episode number 21. Ah! Today, we got a tag duel special. I'm teaming up with my boy, Steven Trifonoski. And you know what, guys? Me and Steven, we're an unstoppable team. I have every bit of confidence in us that we're gonna send Charlie and Jesse to the Shadow Realm. It's a very special episode. This episode is the second last episode before the season finale of the GX era, which will be the very next episode of Duel Night. So guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. It's gonna be insane. Duel Night, welcome back, let's go. We are on a very, very special episode today. Not only is Charlie coming back, Moist Critical, for another amazing episode, but it is the first ever tag duel on Duel Night. I'm so excited, let's do this. Yeah, hello guys, welcome back to Duel Night episode 29. I'm sure you can see by the title, it's a goddamn special one. So believe it or not, we do read all of your comments. And one thing keeps coming up again and again, tag duels. And uh, we didn't respond, but we sure as hell made sure it would happen eventually. And even better than just a tag duel, we're doing it with Moist Critical. So I hope you guys are gonna enjoy this because it's gonna be crazy. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm back to beat these cowards again. Episode 29, baby, and it's a tag duel. I'm kind of a veteran, I played on the Xbox Live Arcade, so I know a thing or two about it, and I'm paired up with Jesse, so I'm feeling extremely confident today. Alright guys, we just finished drafting and I believe that Steve and I have the best tag dueling strategy that you guys have ever seen. This is the Hero Double Trouble. My deck is the starting deck and if I can go first, I will go first. Here is my deck list. So as you guys can see in my deck, I have all the spell and traps that we need to finish Jesse and Charlie. What my deck does is sets up Steven with all the hero cards. Steven is playing Neo Spatians, well Elemental Hero Neos, and I have all the Necro Shades and all the Elemental Heroes in my deck. I can easily set up Necro Shade in the graveyard so I can alley-oop Steven by letting him normal summoning Elemental Hero Neos without tributing. He has all access to all the Neos fusion monsters as well. So if you can normal summon Neos without tributing alongside with his Hummingbird or Aqua Dolphin or Dark Panther, he can easily contact 
fuse to summon those big Neo Fusion monsters. My deck just does all the alley oop. The other thing that my deck provides is, of course, the emergency call. This card can search any element of your monster directly from the deck to the hand, and most importantly, synergizing with Steven's deck, I can search element to heal Neo's alias. Not only is this card a 1900 beat stick, but you can actually additionally normal summon him for this card to be treated as an element to heal Neo's, so that way that makes Steven's contact fusion strategy easier to access. I'm very excited for this strategy. Remember guys, I am the starting engine and Steven is the finisher. I can't wait to send Charlie and Jesse Button to the Shadow Realm. Me and Sam on the same team. We are literally the Hardy Boys. There is no way we are going to lose this game. This match, it's over. Our decks are absolutely insane. The way we synergized our decks together was truly next level team. Oh! The Dudley boys actually just called me and, and they wanted to thank them for having the third boys, and that's us, the winning boys. My deck list is Neospatian Heroes that takes advantage of Elemental Hero Neos and a bunch of cards that synergize with Sam's Hero deck, combining together, making a deck that Jaden Yuki would be very proud of. Well, thanks. I had no idea that you believed in me so much. One of the coolest strategies of my deck is Chain Material. Whenever I use Polymerization, I could chain chain material, and then I'm able to fuse from my deck, making Rainbow Neos the most amazing card for this format that is literally gonna be so power crept in the second it's touched on the field, and that is really a huge part of the deck. Second cool strategy of the deck is using Dark Panther, utilizing its strategy, its skill, and ability to stay, take my opponent's big monsters. And I was peaked a little bit at the draft, I kind of know what cards we're going to be facing off against, and I'm going to be able to use their boss monsters against them. My deck aims to be as simple as possible, even a caveman can comprehend it. I'm just summoning big numbers. I'm looking at blue eyes, trying to get them out there. The whole deck is around tribute summoning, uh, looking for alley-oops that Jesse sets up for me to get these big beat sticks on the board and get a little wacky with them. I'm excited to summon blue eyes, plasma, you name it. Let's get dueling. I am super excited to be paired up with Charlie, and he's shown his promise already, man. He's uh, won the first stone he went, so he's undefeated so far, and uh, now he's paired up with me. Let's make this nice and easy. I'm gonna beat them just like usual. Now, this deck here looks terrible. Now, hold on a second. I know, this deck itself doesn't have any win conditions, but that's where me and Charlie work together. His deck is all the beaters. I'm the setup, and he deals the finishing blow. So my job is to summon all these normal monsters and then use the synergies with the spells and traps they have to be in control of the game. That way he gets these big monsters like Guildford the Lightning, Destiny of Plasma, Storm Shooter, Barrel Dragon, whatever he wants, he'll summon it. And then those will dominate the field so he can win the game. Charlie's my arm in on the supply lines. I just gotta keep giving him the resources to hit them with everything he's got, and it shouldn't be a problem. They don't stand a chance. All right, guys, welcome to the very first episode of Duel Night Tag Duel. Let's go! Today, we got Jesse Button and Mr. Charlie. Hey. Moist Critical <laughs> versus the best champions in the world, baby. You know Jeff I mean? Hardy, Matt Hardy, Let's Edge go. Christian, the Dudley Boys, the greatest team in history of mankind. Undertaker. Let's go! Hey. Yeah! Like Triple H, Shawn Michaels, baby. I don't know, guys. We got the better content creator here and the better duelist <laughs> here. So this is looking pretty one-sided. Yeah, what are you talking about better? First off, wait a second. He went personal with Wait, that. hold on, yeah, hold that was on. Just me. I have to. Yeah. He went the personal. better content creator <laughs> and the better duelist is right here. Let's go! <laughs> you know what? Honestly, you know what, Charlie? You beat me episode mm -hmm. 21. I want to rematch with the RPS. Honestly, right? he didn't really beat you. He obliterated you. <laughs> he got into your mind and knew what you were going to do. Bro, you're on my team. Oh, my bad. You got obliterated. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah, you're too smart, bro. Right. You got in the head. You got in the head. head. Okay, in my head. okay. In my head. so I will start, and then who's next? That'll be me. And it's you. I go next. And then it's Steven, and then Charlie gets the last one. Charlie gets attacked first. So that means Charlie gets it. Yeah, I wasn't about to say that. All right, ready, guys? Yep. It's time to duel. Cool. All right, guys, get ready. Ooh. All right, so. I gotta talk to my teammate, of course. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Teammate, show me your hand. Wow, this hand is amazing. All right, I will start first with a draw. I will draw for turn. 
All right, so you guys see your hand? Yes, yes. All right, we can definitely coordinate this very, very, 100%. very, very well. I think first, first, I'm gonna start off. This is what we're working with. We're gonna keep this for the Ooh, very cool. end. 100%. Yeah, man. Keep that for the very end. So we can do a combo with these cards. All right, guys, so me and my teammate discuss what we're gonna do first. So now, we're gonna normal summon, of course. And I'm gonna take your Neo's alias, baby. Mm -hmm. Big boy. Like, he's basically baby Neo's, and he's 900 attack, which is pretty beefy. Uh, and of course, I'm gonna set this card face down, uh, and I'm gonna end my turn. Face cool. the wrath of Alias. Nice. Draw for turn? Yes, sir. Not ideal. <laughs> Just like their whole decks. I will. Normal summon. Bakoichi the Freight Car. Cheater. Whoa. That's coming. a scary card. I think it has a whole 500 attack points. It does. Nice. I, I know what's coming now, Steve. All right, guys, so Jesse just summoned the Koichi in attack position, okay? There are only two things that Jesse could possibly set up. Zoom into my mind. I am thinking right now. I am doing all the calculations. Jesse can only do two things. He has nomenclature of the ultimate creature trap card. Nomenclature ordering, ordering. It's the Ujama yellow card. It's that trap card that basically summons every single copy of the monster with the same name. So we can get access to three Bakoichi immediately, okay? I know that Jesty is, or. Well, we work on synergy. We were combo our weak cards together to make truly unbeatable weaker cards. Combos. Okay. Huh? What do you want to say? I said your cards are weaker weak, cards. and you're going to turn into weaker cards because oh, no, no, the cards that you're cards. going to bring out are going to be in the graveyard. And the last time I checked, Ooh. they are very weak in the graveyard. Okay, so we saw each other's hands, me and Moist, and um, I think we're going to go over something we call Protocol D. You guys will see what that means. Yes, sir. Well, I, I disagree. I, think, uh, I just yes. prove I'm wrong. Right? Yeah, I just disagree with that like, entirely. <laughs> 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 Yo, these guys are like, when you're that wrong, how do you even respond to that? Like, yeah, it's, it's not kinda, even an argument. It was just kind of embarrassing to listen to. Okay, I stopped listening to you guys like three minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> let's go, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, continue. I'm ending my turn two minutes ago. Oh, oh, oh <laughs> my turn! Draw! Oh. <laughs> it's over. It's over. Are you ready? Face the wrath. Show us what you got. <laughs> the Paradox Brothers! You just basically an air hummingbird. Hummingbird. We're at 16,000 life points now. This card is literally going to double that eventually. It allows me to gain 500 life points times the amount of cards my opponent has in hand. So imagine if we could protect this card for like five, six turns, Sam Cross uses the effect, we'll literally be at like 50,000 billion life points in a few turns. So effect, let's go. For those who don't know what it does, which is basically everyone in the world, what this card does is I calculate how many cards he had in his hand and I calculate this three, right? Yes, sir. And that's times 500, 1,500 life points for us. Thank you so much. It's our birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Merry and Christmas. I'm going to set my trap and pass. Hummingbird is putting in serious work right now. I wouldn't be surprised if by the end of the duel we end up with infinity life points. Draw. Show us what you got, Charlie. Oh. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good with that. I think it's nice and simple. I will set in the face down defense position and one back row. Just a playful little guy. So let me explain protocol D. Now you could interpret it as to Koichi or to draw. Either way, we're going plus a goddamn million here. Koichi says flip draw a card. What people often forget is it also says I can you draw one extra card for every Bokoichi on the field. So I now draw two. That's pretty solid. But with machine duplication or limiting the league to get two other Bokoichis out of my deck, that flip effect draws four. Now that's a swing and advantage they will not be able to come back from. Yeah. And I'll end my turn. All right, Charlie, guess what? I actually read you like a book. Shine ball, shine ball! No, it's not no, a drop of turn, okay? Dead. You know what? I'm gonna tell you right now, Steven. Yeah. In my calculations, that card is right there, Bokoichi. Do you okay. know what Bokoichi does? No. When it's flipped, you draw a card. But if there's a Bokoichi on the field, you draw an additional card for your Bokoichi. <laughs> so I know what Jesse's trying to do. He's trying to Yo, you think you can outsmart the smartest, I know. I know. second he's smartest a, player in the world? I know what he's gonna do. That's a set, Bokoichi. Yeah. He Wait, so machine. what does that leave you, Steven, if he's the second no, smartest? No, we're a teammate, baby. We're a teammate. Yeah, we're a teammate, but I'm smart. Oh, Wait, Sam, you, Sam, 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 also, are you also, taking that, Sam? Are you gonna let him say he's I'm better also than more you? handsome. Oh, 100%. He's more handsome, he's more smart. No, nah, I think those are fighting words. 100%. We're boys, <laughs> But bro. he's the second best everything else. All right. And no, you're I'm... 7 hundred. <laughs> so, I know 100% sure they're trying to bait us into attacking the, the Koichi, but I do have a card of an we answer. We have an deck. answer to this. Oh, to we have an answer for everything, of baby. Course. Come on, now. Why, why did I even ask? Why did I even waste my breath? Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna attack first. Okay, enter battle phase. Okay. I'm going to attack with, well, what's the type of Koichi? It's huh? relevant. Attack with coming Burger Number Koichi. I'll activate Just the League of Uniform Nomenclature. <laughs> what? So I gotta summon two more Bokoichis from my deck. Whoa! I knew Jesse had that trap card. Watch what's about to happen next. Take Whoa. it easy, baby. 
the other responds. Send both of them. Get wrecked. Let's go. Get wrecked. I, I didn't know we had that. How did uh, I get there? Let's go. How did you see this? Oh, oh, on my okay. sleeve. Bandit right. Keith, okay, baby. That's correct. In the veins. <laughs> yeah. He goes to the grave. Seven tools of the bandit. Damn. Sam is sharpening his, uh, his gameplay right now. I'm impressed. But, uh, We'll get him in the next play. Minus a thousand, and he goes, and I will attack with Neil's alias. What do we have to work with? I think we are okay with this. Get yeah. attack. All right, a little unfortunate. We will yeah, make it's okay. Right. So, how much you lose? How much you lose? 1,400 life points. Minus 1,400, right? Cool. And so then you're at we also game. And we'll activate, of course, Hummingbird's effect. Charlie, cards in hand. Four. Oh, <laughs> Charlie. Yeah, I'm a little gluttonous. Charlie, I guess it's Christmas for me. Putting us at 18,500 uh, 18, to your 40,000. Yo, 14, activate, of course, now Jesse Cotton and, of course, Charlie activate polymerization. Using, of course, my Necro Shaman and Wild Heart in my hand. Send these two cards to the graveyard to summon, of course, the main man himself, Necro Shaman. Where's Necro Shaman? So let's read this. This says This monster cannot be special summon except by fusion, whatever. When this card is special summon, destroy one monster your opponent's side of the field. And then it's like one monster from your opponent's graveyard, and then special summon it to your opponent's side of the field. Ooh, so we gotta swap our cards. Oh, All see, right. oh, is that right? Is that the Nekoichi, Charlie? Um, was my calculations correct? Well, I, I don't, I wouldn't know. Oh, really? Oh, Neku Shaman, pop that monster special in Yeah? Yeah. Whoa, you're so smart, man. See? You might just actually be the smartest player after me, Steven, actually. And now we have to do this. 100% beautiful. Now we so have to, be, we have to make sure that we have absolutely no options for them yes. to come back. Yes, Element totally. to your emergency call. Any response, Charlie? Not for me. Would you like to have an Ash Blossom on that? Uh, well, I, mean, no, I, no. May, I, I may have drawn one, but I don't need to play it's it yet. So, so such a beautiful Such, such a beautiful, beautiful combo, combo, dude. Absolutely. I will add Element to your Straddles directly from my deck to my hand. And of course, now, I would like to Normal Summon Element to your Straddles. Okay, Straddles has an amazing ability. For each element of your monster I control, I can pop, I can either search, or I can pop score trap cards in the field. So, boom, boom. High noon, baby. Pop those two. Hmm. I believe this is called Swan Time Bomb. That is uh, not what I would have loved to see. I don't think we can afford to use that. What's no. your Yeah. No, not bad. We can use this card, though, so I think we have to go with that. Yeah, probably. All right, well, you're the lead player, so. All right. <sighs> Uh, They're trembling. There I can actually hear it. We're gonna have to yeah. use the order to charge here. Any response? No response, sir. All right. Okay. So we're going to offer the little train guy and sir. destroy probably the shaman, right? Or is that only once per turn? Like once? It's only when it's summoned. Only when it's summoned? So that card can count as Neos alias. I'm gonna hear Neos probably kill the Neos alias. Okay. Then we'll kill the Neos alias then. No problem. Thank you. Unfortunately, we lose our common charity. Yep. And we also, we also lose the McClinchy. Yes, we have to sacrifice All those. right, Steven, uh, that's all I have for you guys. We've cleared your entire board. Amazing. I end my turn. I just cleared Jesse's and Charlie's board because I used my brain. <laughs> Absolute easy. Amazing. Draw. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> this is uh, quite unfortunate. I will normal summon Cloudy and Turbulence. Okay. It's effect to gain one Cloudian uh, fog counter because I control a Cloudian monster. No and problem. then I'll, I will remove the counter to summon a smoke ball from my hand, deck, or grave. True. Okay. Okay, draws not been the greatest in this point on. I think you guys can see that in my facial expression. Fortunately, not doing the best job of hiding it, but the Cloudian is somewhat of a saving grace. So while it summons this fog monster, it has the other ability that it can't be destroyed by battle. Unfortunately, if it goes to defense, it kills itself, so I, I can't really just protect myself forever. However, it does decrease the damage taken by 800 each time, and it's a perpetual body on the field until Charlie's ready to use it for his tribute summons. So at the very least, this is something. Also, it happens to just tie, pair up nicely against this, this hummingbird, so inching away into the game. We should be good here, though. Cool. I'll enter battle phase. Yep. My, my Claudian monster will attack your Neospatian. No problem. Okay. Results? Destroyed? Yep. My monster can't be shot by battle, though, so... And I guess that, uh... Unfortunately, it concludes my turn. Oh, God. I'm, really... I'm, uh, I'm a bit nervous. I think... Yeah, it's, it's a little... What are they, right? it's a little what are they uh, scheming about? Yep. 
Probably nothing. It's oh, whoa! Nothing did you hear good. that? An earthquake from there's trembling. Oh, normal summon. Another one. <laughs> yeah, effect. Oh no. Gain life points. There's so much. How much you losing? Fifteen hundred. Yeah, have you ever seen in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh, uh, two duelists have twenty thousand life points before? Right, twenty thousand to your fourteen six hundred. And then we will enter the battle phase and attack this one. Not my baby. And then for... With, with, with the hunger, right? Yes. And then attack for lots of damage. 1100? Yep. Yep. Yeah, I don't think they get the, got the memo. In order to win Yu-Gi-Oh, you have to have more life points than another person. That's what, I, that's what I'm thinking. Actually, no, you have to reduce your opponent's life points to zero. Okay, oh, sure. Okay. Attack with straddles. <laughs> Steven, attack with straddles. So you lose another thousand. And honestly, you're, you're just going to have to pass at that point. You're at 12,500. 12, 12, you know what? They do have the best player in the world, and Jesse, so maybe they'll find some way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I end. Yeah, sorry. We end. Yes. It's a team effort. All right, Charlie, we got a lot of good draws. Let's get one of them. We have, we have plenty of life points to get a little goofy with, I'd Do say. we have plenty? What do we have? 12,500. And they're at 20,000 even. Mm hmm Okay, so yeah, we just lead with that. All right. So what, what card do we want in the grave? <laughs> Probably Stratos, Stratos right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we'll start. So I got a pretty strong draw here, and I've convinced Jesse to let us go just full hog wild here. I'm going to use the entire hand to get Plasma on the board. It might be a little too aggressive, but if, you know, there's no reason not to let it all hang loose. Charlie is not one to mess around, man. You know, I got a... He's the champion from last time, so I'm going to trust his instincts here. We could hold back and maybe chill a little, but Plasma is pretty enticing, especially with Sam on so few cards. So, let's see if it's enough to win the duel. Soul Exchange. Mm. And I'm targeting the Stratos for this. No problem. No I don't have a battle phase, though. That's fine. Just letting you know. We don't need it. Sorry, my bad. Okay. I think we do need it. And you have to play the other spell. Oh, it has to. And then we're also going to Tribute Doll. Oh. So, so you activate Soul Exchange, Tribute Doll, the Stratos? Yes. yes. Okay, cool. It's fine. And then it's... Yep. Okay. Uh, specifically not there. Oh, right. Because it has to be in the same... Wait. But this one has to be in the same. Oh, Does we get a bounce yeah. for this card? Or do we want to bounce that? So when we this discard this to bring this back, we want to bounce them. Okay. The so yeah. I can just play them pretty much anywhere but Anywhere there. but there. Yeah. <laughs> so the creator <laughs> over here then. Yep. Any response? No response. These are gone. Okay. You can't attack, just let you know. We're not trying to attack. All right. So we're going to use that. No. Okay. Oh, sure, sure. Yeah, yeah. And then I'm sending the Storm Shooter. Yes. Um, doesn't it has to just target your card? Discard a card in special summon? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's so target, like, grave, and then... It's target, discard, then special. So you can't... Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah, okay. So you have to bring something else. So, you, yeah, so uh, next turn you can bring it back. Okay. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Yeah, you can just bring that bad boy back. Yeah, that's what's so funny. Yeah, that's what's so funny. Alright. Alright. You ready? I'm ready. Now we're gonna tribute all three of these. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, Obelisk! Wait, wait, how? You didn't normal summon special yet? summon no. Destiny Hero Plasma. I, I didn't I never used the oh, normal no. summon because we this used the tribute. Special though. summon anyway. Oh, oh true. No. Oh, <laughs> right into the plasma. Oh my god, oh my god no. Uh, What's the attack of plasma? 1900. 1900. But we have a special ability. We get to suck one up. Oh, shit. So we're gonna take that shaman. How much did he gain? He's Half of that attack? Yeah. It also negates the effect of all your monsters. Oh, so, 800 nice. more. That's all right. Guys, Plasma is not what I'm worried about. Charlie can just summon Plasma all he wants. But my entire play right here, right now, was to alley-oop Steven. That's why I summoned Necro Shaman, to send Necro Shade to the graveyard. So that way that Steven can easily summon Elemental Hero Neos and attack over the Plasma whenever he draws the Neo space in his deck. So, gives you 950, more. right? It's, this is 19? Oh, yeah, yeah 950. It's 950. No, 950. What's the attack of the 2850. That's huge. I, I still can't do battle phase, right? Because nope. the soul is still changed. cannot because okay. of soul change, yeah. We're going to have around 40 turns to join out because we have a lot of life points. Yeah. That's going to end my turn. That's pretty insane, Charlie. Good play. And you're gaining zero life points because I have no cards. That's negated anyway. Oh, that's also true. Because I think the kill out of we have enough issues as is, but it's, <laughs> true. yes. True. Not huge enough. I don't know what the kill is. Okay. Yes, 100%. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, Absolutely, yeah. yes, 100%. 
All this is gonna be the perfect draw. I, 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 I actually uh, cannot believe it. Meanwhile, I'm drawing these. Yeah. You know, that's fine. Those are good <laughs> for us. <laughs> 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 yes. Yes. And draw. Oh my. That I, was like, a, Jesse Botton's deck is really good, actually. Yeah, I think Jesse actually has the best. He's really good at doing nothing. I, I think just Charlie's he's crying just, out of like you know, sheer yeah, respect. Yeah, Charlie, you, uh, do you need a massage, bro? Or Charlie, if you want, bro, I can take you to a nice Thai massage. You're no, carrying, no. carrying Jesse a lot. No, no, your no. Backs, you know, <laughs> little Swedish massage. It's a team little effort. Thai massage. I will you know what I'm <laughs> the battle phase and plasma will attack you in the Yeah, no problem, yeah, no problemo, bro. Just Oh my! Oh my God! We don't even need. We don't even need that. <laughs> activate it, bro! Activate it! I'm not gonna lie, guys. I was a little scared of this plasma. I thought we actually lost the duel. This card seems way too overpowered for this format. But then I literally top deck the only out in my entire deck. Let's go! Nice. What's it do? Yeah, he's Neil's 500. He's at 2950, so we can run over it. Normal seven years. It's a lot? Yes, it's a lot. It's not cheating. Boom! Boom! Do you know why you can do that? Because we have the Ha ha ha! Declare Necro. Remember what? what? Steven said declare Necro. Declare. Declare this card. <laughs> Me and Sam are the best team. We are literally peanut butter and jelly, baby. I'm the top goal. This is why we're so crazy. Tele our telepathy? So, we <laughs> so Steven declared Necroshade's effect. We can tribute. One of his cards in the graveyard. One of the hero monster. Wow. Hold on. Wait, I just cannot believe what I just witnessed with our back-to-back -back draws for insane. this exact scenario. Wow. It's so absurd. I don't even know what to say. So that's, it, this is a 3,000, so it's attack. <laughs> attack. I'll get all that. That is on the that is truly. Well, that was just one of our. Which strategies. one of these cards should I use to stop that? Well, what? Well, I wouldn't. I wouldn't even use them yet. Yeah, I wouldn't save it. Yeah, save them. Save, save it. Them. I think I should save these. What do you think, guys? Oh, he has Karibo. Damn it! Attack. It's over. Okay, have your card back. You got me. So we take 150. Yep. What more can be said? This is just the saddest moment of 2022. And then I think we shall pass. Can we draw that? Pass. Yeah, I'm gonna manifest. <laughs> yes. Beautiful. Well, not yet. Yeah, maybe, that's, maybe uh, soon. <laughs> it's not quite what you asked for. Take your card back, guys. Here. Oh, thank you. Appreciate you. That'll be my turn. Uh, you can set it. I can use it. Oh, uh, after I set that. Nice. Nice. Draw. Oh, this is his turn. He doesn't have cards. Cool. I am going to look at your face downs. Beautiful. I'm just going to enter battle phase. Attack into your monster. Yeah? <laughs> you know what's funny? But you kind of predicted weak monsters and weaker monsters keep going to the right? That is true. That is true. Really? And you oh, know what? Shut it. Sorry. Who, 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 who am I attacking Charlie? Oh, I shut am. it! <laughs> <laughs> I had my turn. <laughs> what are the cards? Mm -hmm. Charlie, cards in hand? No, zero. Zero wow. cards. Are, are, are you like a magician? You just made your hand disappear? Yeah, no. Well, I'm, I'm, handy, I'm, yeah, I'm using it. <laughs> Set a card face down. This happened with the Ojamas, and it's happening again. Why do I do this to myself every goddamn time? Uh, Set another card face down. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go ahead. <laughs> what exactly does Jesse and Charlie deck do, actually? Like, like what do they do? <laughs> Is this gold format? They're just T-setting and pass? <laughs> Draw. Oh. Excuse <laughs> you, Alfred. Hmm? 100%. Chrysalis, Chicky! Okay. It's, it's just a bird, but don't. Okay. It's 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 a scary. But, wait, doesn't it bring out strong monster into stronger monster? Exactly the effect, teammate. In fact, help us three of those in there. There's two. We already went through two. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> nice. We fucking got him. <laughs> Yo, do you guys want to see a magic trick? Okay. Nothing happened in the last thirty minutes, and you guys. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> it's a magic trick. Okay. Well, attack. you stopped this. Which attack does your chicken have? Uh, hold on one second. Do some math. Shine balls are 500, right? And no, no. Like just, defense? Just don't risk it. I, don't <laughs> I want to risk it, baby. How big is the chicken? 600. Shine balls are 500, right? Attack. How much is this? 600. No, I no, am no. a gambler. I, I am gamble. literally a degenerate gambler, and I will degenerate gamble a little bit more. Chrysalis Chicky, destroy his shine ball. Never expect this to live a battle? No, but it will. 
That's big. It's okay. That's so big for us. That's huge. Wow. Signal that's stations that's just changed the whole tide of the duel. Elemental here with Yos, destroy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the little guy did a great job, honestly. I will set this. I got you. That one's for you. That's why I made sure to put it as close to you as possible. Thank and you. I will pass. <sighs> yes. Whoa. I guess we can't do anything, eh? I'll save it. I'll pass. Another pile of trash is what it is. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Charlie, can I Draw. Mm -hmm. Emergency call. Okay. I am going to activate e-call. I am going to search. I am going to get, of course, Wildheart. Add Wildheart to my hand. Now, Steven? Yes. I'm going to activate, of course, Polymerization. Oh. Fusing, of course, my elements are here, Wildheart. And, of course, my blade is from my hand to summon, of course, the man himself, Elemental Hero! Wild Edge. <laughs> <laughs> What's it card do? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's a old oh, under triangle attacks every monster in the field. Oh my goodness. Yes, sir. Sound very broken. And guess what? You know what? Listen, you know what? In life you gotta get justice. Yes, justice. You, you just gotta give him his justice. Yes. R Righteous of Justice! <laughs> Jesse, Charlie, you guys suck. <laughs> For each element to hear monsters in the field, pop this destroy back, spawn traps up to number here monsters in the field. There's element to hear Neil's in the field and Wild Edge, so see ya. That's unfortunate. That you don't like to see that, but it could have been worse. No, I don't think it could have been worse. No, there's actually. We've I've, I've still got a card in the hand, like. You're too optimistic, man. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty bad. There's still, there's still a card hey. in his hand. Hey. Oh, we'll we'll just our hero now. emerges, and are united we stand. Wow. Yo, we got lucky. They got lucky. Because th if that was a blue Oh, no, it doesn't matter. You just got run away. Enter battle, please. Um, I'll need to attack for 2,600. Charlie, any response? <laughs> well, hold on. No, I'm good. Yes, sir. Uh, 3,000 for Niels. Mm -hmm. V-Rex. And, of course, Chicky, 600. Putting you and Mr. Jesse Button right there at 6,150 life points to our 20 even. Watch this draw though. Oh, it'll be, I can't wait for it to it's be a shine ball. It's gonna be nuts. Damn, that would have been so good. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, it's, it's all right. Yo guys, don't ever let me put these goddamn level two lower vanillas in my deck. I know I'm like, yo, John King, but these level two weenies are not very good. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, this is bad. Yeah, it's uh. I'll set a card face down, mm. and then I'll uh, set another card face down, yeah. and I'll call it a turn. My goal. Sure thing. Draw. Yeah, we should just do it. Are you ready for a very amazing play? I'm ready. I will set one card, and then normal summon a card. Okay. And then I'm going to bring out the boss of my deck. Actually, the boss's uncle, because this is the boss. Flame Neos! I love you, Jaden! Go to that... the deck. I do not know what those do. Sorry? They go to the deck. Oh. Is this, is this, does Jaden play this deck? Yeah, he plays the deck, yeah. Okay, so yeah, it goes to your deck. deck. <laughs> and if you don't know, Neil Space says that the fusion monsters cannot be returned to the extract during the end phase, so. And on top of that, it's a game 500. <laughs> And on top of that, he has a special ability that no one knows about. What's special ability? Even though it's written on the card, that it gains 400 attack for each card. Each spot. It right? even has another special ability. What is it? That it can actually get Milano a girlfriend. No. Wow. Yeah. No, I don't think that's even capable. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think, yeah, I don't think it's capable. <laughs> okay. So four. Four times four, two. 16. 16, 12. Plus five. Eight. 21. 16. Plus 25, 4,600. Yeah, sounds good. And I believe that there are 6,150. I'm attacking Crystal's tricky. Go ahead. One of them must eventually go through. No, but honestly, there's a card in his deck called Justice Break. If you if attack into it, yeah. and Chicky doesn't kill it, you can destroy all monsters in the field. Let him. <laughs> you know, are you going to do that? Yes. All right, Steven, I believe in you. You're you believe team. in me? 100%. Okay. Crystal's tricky. Kill it! If it survives, you can use Justice Break. He's not, he's not going to have it, though. How big is it? 
500. You said 500? 600. Yes, 600. 600. No, it's 500, right? It's 600. You said it was 500? It's 600. I you misclicked. <laughs> I told you! I told you! I'm gonna attack for game! Let's go! Jaden Yuki! How much damage is this? 4,600 plus. 26? 72? Yeah, 6150. It'll be game if you take it. Damn. So I will right. activate Birthright to bring back a normal monster from my graveyard. <laughs> oh, yeah. And it'll stand against the world. Cloudy and smoke ball. Okay, you know what? You know, you know, Steven, you know what? I, I, this is, we're in Tampa. We're in Charlie's home. Mm -hmm. That's, that's homie drop. Let's what? Homie drop. What's homie drop? No, don't do this to us. Goddamn, this is the goddamn BM these guys always do. This isn't, this isn't giving me a turn. This is making me suffer. Have some mercy for me. Put me out of my misery. Denzel did the same thing with a stupid time wizard. Just finish me. But Charlie's a champion. I don't know if we can give him an extra turn. I am a dual knight no, champion. You know what? It, uh, <laughs> <laughs> he is. So you know what, Steven? Let's do it. We just hold him down. Okay. All right. You believed in me to attack with Chicky. I will believe in you to do this. All right. You have 30 deals attacking for that. Oh, we don't even leave us for the smoke ball? Fine. No, no, no smoke ball. All right. No, we don't like the smoke ball. We'll take 4,400. Yep. And then we're going to psych. We're going to leave you with another turn. The end. And we're going to pass. This is the heart of the cards moment. Come on, Charlie. Come on, do it. You know what? Sam trusted me earlier. I'm going to trust him now. We are the best team after all. Jesse, Charlie, you guys can have one more turn. That pretty much sums up well, the entire game uh, for us. Well you do realize why Dragon yes. is Mystic Shine Ball in hand. That was pretty good. I'll pass. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, go. Ready? My turn. Ready? Draw. We'll get them in the next game. <laughs> yeah, the next, the next one. What should we do here? It's a very tough game state for us. Yeah. You know what? I'm just gonna pass. <laughs> no, 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 no. A homie drop is a whole turn. For, you know? You guys are a team. I know how this works. Octavian Enchanted Fitting Room. To pay 800 to pick. <laughs> I can look at the top four of my deck and so many normal monsters. Sure. Now that I've drawn them all, I yeah. got none. You're not good. Nope. Ooh. Nope. 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 Yep, that sums up my game. I reel two more of them, by the way. <sighs> is it the pass? Crystal Chicky is Jesse. I'm gonna end this. Can I just end this? I'm gonna end this on my own terms. Normal summon? No! Negate attack! Get it again! Negate attack! Sorry! Sorry, not today! Not today! Uh, go ahead. Is it 450? Yes. My turn! I draw! For the final battle! I'm at the Neos! Tribute summon over your uncle or another guy! Enter the battle phase! Crystal Chicky! Kill the monster! And then I'm at the Neos! End the. Um... <laughs> yeah! <laughs> All right, well, we'll get you in game two, don't worry, man. That was tough. That was rough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I let Charlie down. This is my second tag duel I've ever done, and I've lost both of them. Pretty badly both times, too. I don't know if I just suck at this, but maybe it's a skill set I'm not ready for. All I know is uh, to keep practicing, and I'm sorry, Charlie. We'll avenge them. I'll, I'll, we'll fix it next time. We'll get it. Yeah, you're just unfortunate all around. There's nothing Jesse or myself could have done about it. Just the heart of the cards wasn't on our side today. Just bad draws. Maybe the plasma play might have been a little too aggressive off rip, but at the end of the day, if we're gonna lose, I'd rather it be losing with some pride intact, and that was pretty intense. Give me the tag team belts, baby. We are the GOATs. This counts as, this is another victory. This counts as an official Duel Night victory, right guys? This counts as an official Duel Night victory. Let's go. Another victory in the book. Told you. Yeah, even with the homie drop, uh, they, 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 they still suck. I'm, I'm just joking, guys. They don't suck. Yeah, they, they, we, we absolutely dusted them. Thank you guys so much for watching. This tag deal was very special and a lot of fun to build. If this is something you guys want to keep seeing in future seasons of Duel Night, please let us know in the comments below. And just like I mentioned before, we read your comments. So if you have any other cool ideas you want to see, we will try our best to make Duel Night as special as possible every single time. Next episode of Duel Night is the GX season finale. That means we get to crown our GX champion next week, so that'll be awesome. And that means next after that, we get Synchro Monsters, my favorite summoning mechanic personally. So, you guys have a lot to look forward to. And if you get on Patreon, you get the early access. So make sure you guys go there. Peace. I'm super happy to have been on episode 29 of Duel Night. Tag duels, I'm a huge fan of. I actually used to play them on the Xbox Live Arcade for 5Ds, so this was nice and nostalgic. It felt good. This is a much better format for tag duels, so big thanks to the gang for having me back. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Make sure to stay tuned for next episode, the very last episode of the GX era. You guys can't miss it. Make sure to check out Patreon as well. Absolute blast. 
filming Duel Night with you guys. We'll see you guys next episode. Peace. Guys, thank you so much for watching this Duel Night episode. This is the very first tag duel. Let us know in the comments on what kind of crazy content you guys want to see next here on Duel Night. I know a lot of you guys have been anticipating this duel right here, but guys, any more suggestions, leave in the comments from below. And a huge shout out to Charlie for coming back here on this episode. Guys, next episode is the last and final episode for Duel Night GX. Stay tuned for that, and I'll catch you guys on the Patreon. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's your boy Sam from Team Sam Sam signing out. All right, guys. Peace. Fuck your beat. Hip hop.